What we are looking at here is a building with no 90 degree exterior corners and um, it's not this isn't that difficult there are other methods you can use but this one's going to provide you with more accuracy and what I'm going to try and do in the video is provide you with a method to create a couple of guidelines that can be used to lay everything out on the inside now this method right here is not going to guarantee that you're going to be able to get these uh, walls perfectly straight uh, but it will provide you with a method for creating walls on the inside that are straight. And this method could also be used for a variety of different things. So with these guidelines, you'll be able to measure from these guidelines to the walls and then snap your lines for the wall. So this is an excellent way if you have a straight wall on the on one side at least and even if you don't have a straight line all you need are two points and I'll show you how you can do that so the first thing we are going to do will be to start with the building foundation let's just pretend like it's already been poured and we want to make our make sure our walls are going to be 90 degrees or um, to this one here so all of the walls that run this way are going to be parallel to this line all of the walls that run this way are going to be perpendicular to this line or at 90 degrees. So the first thing that you are going to do will be to draw a line. I've already drew this. This is the completed uh, segment here, but you're going to draw a line and then you're going to create two points here. And these points can be anywhere along the line within reason. And then you will draw two circles the same size. And these can be smaller or larger. The larger they are, the more accurate I think it's going to be for your um, line here. And then you'll simply just connect where the circles intersect. These points right here will give you the 90 degree angle. So let's go ahead and run through it. So start with our parallel line. So this line will be parallel to here. You might have to snap a line across here. Um, that might represent your um, building wall, the, the wall framing, bottom plate. So you might need to snap a line across here and get a straight point. If this line is perfectly straight, you won't have to do that. But if it isn't, start with a straight line uh, so that you can create a parallel line from that line. So next up, you'll take two points. And if these points are too far away, and your circles are too big, then you could see where it would be way out here somewhere. And uh, so if this line was over here and I went with a larger circle, you know, my intersecting points might not be on the foundation. So be aware of that. So you will draw a circle. Then you will simply draw another circle, same exact size. And then, of course, when you connect a line through the intersecting points, you will now have created a 90 degree angle. So once you have your guideline here, you will be able to measure off of it and uh, create lines for your wall framing layout. So, for example, if I had a wall measurement that was 30 foot off of this line, off of this point here. And I came over here and I measured this distance from here to here is 39 feet. I just simply come over here, any spot along the line here, measure over 39 feet, make a mark, and then snap a line. So hope that makes sense. Now another thing I would like to point out, if you can, if you have it, try to use a different colored um, line here. So we use uh, red most of the time for our wall layout lines in our chalk boxes and uh, we used to have a separate chalk box with blue chalk in it that we would use for any wall any lines like these that we needed that we're going to use for guidelines so keep that in mind that way they, they don't get confusing so uh, use different colored lines for your guidelines to save yourself some grief so that's it for the video. If you like it, you know what to do. Hit the old thumbs up button. And if you think it was helpful, um, send a link to someone you know. Let's promote this uh, channel and uh, get some more people over here interested in learning.